Put and touch the garment of Jesus. It's a stash. It's like one of the cases I had some years ago. A woman, a woman of the age of 55 years. This woman was bleeding, bleeding, bleeding. They invited me. I went to the house and I preached. She was, she, they brought her outside the house. She was bleeding. She was bleeding for how many years? For two years and a half. She was 55 years old. I stretched my hand and I prayed, and the bleeding stopped instantly. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It's a time to utter the word of God. I, I, I'm coming with the answers. It's a time. But hear me. Every human being can receive blessing from God through me, through yourself, through each other. But you should ask me, why is it that that blessing is not flowing? It's not last. Because of, because there is a barrier of salvation. There's no salvation. That when you were coming here so many years ago, you entered through the door. Am I correct? Yeah. Did, any, did any of us enter through the window? Did we fly through the window? We, we came in through the door. When we are coming into this apartment, there is an entrance to this apartment. One fifteen hundred. Am I correct? Am I correct? Uh -huh. When we are driving with GPS, coming from Oakland, uh, from uh, Berkeley, from uh, from San Francisco, uh, from uh, 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 from, uh, from any part, with any any city in this Alameda County, the GPS will be will be. Directing you to 1500. If you're coming to 1500, 164 Avenue, it will be directing you. But immediately you start coming close to 1500, 164. There's apartment, this apartment close to 1500, GPS will tell you to branch. If you're coming from the other side, it will tell you to branch. But you know that at least you're close to where you are going to. What am I talking about? There is an access to every blessing. Any work we're doing today, there's an access. You can't, go, you can't just start working in any company without an access. Yeah. Am I correct? Mm -hmm. We can't just start doing business without a point of contact. Mr. JC, come out from somewhere. After this meeting, you are going back to your appointment or you are going back to visit anybody, but you must have a contact. Without contact, you can't locate anywhere. In myself, if I, if I, if we stop this program without contact, I can't locate anywhere. There's an access. That access, the Bible said, three, John 16, for God so loved the world that he said, his only begotten son into the world, that whosoever believe in him will not perish, but we have everlasting words. Like three, is in John. Verse 14 of John, he said, as Moses lifted a serpent from the wilderness, so the son of man shall be lifted. And he said that everyone that believes in him shall have eternal life. That's John 3 15. John 3 16, he said, For God so loved the world. Verse 17, he said that the, the wish and the will of God is that anybody will perish. God never wants anyone to perish, but he wants you and I to have everlasting life. Amen. If there is no life in this gospel, I will not be on it. You can't deceive me, I can't be on it. I have gone through ages. I have gone through eyes of death. I have gone through eyes of death. But what my preservation is that the Almighty God sustained me by His spirit. So that salvation, as of the Apostle 4 to have said, there is no salvation. There is no name given among men whereby we must be saved. Salvation, salvation, salvation. Salvation, that's the access to the Almighty God. If your father beat you, if you have a problem with your husband or wife or your son or your daughter or your, or your mother or anybody, the key to go back to whoever you offended or that offended you is the reconciliation. Am I correct? And that reconciliation is an access. Is what? It's an access. It's either your uncle or your good friend that can talk to your brother or sister very well, handed you, carried you, and guide you back into your father or mother or friend that offended you or that you quarreled you with to reconcile you. Access. Access. John 14, 12. John 14, 6. I am the word, the truth, and the life. He said, no one comes to the almighty God. 
accepted by him. No one, no one comes to the Almighty God. As, since I was born, since I was born, I have been to Kenya, I've been to South Africa, I've been to United Arab Emirates up to three, four times. I've been to so many countries, South Africa, I've been to Ghana, I've been to some countries, but I've not heard about any human being that died in this planet Earth and was buried, died in good deaths. I mean, you know, good death is a, a die that where the, where the five senses die. The, the medical um, uh, field, they taught us that the last five senses that dies is the hearing sense. If, the, if the, anybody stops hearing it, that's the end. The poor person is dead. That's what they taught us in the medical field. Now, then I have not had any country let that someone died a good death, the energy, the, the, the heart is stopped bleeding, the uh, eyes, everything closed, and he was buried. And three days later, or two days later, he came back to life. I have not had it, except Jesus. If there is anybody, let me know. I don't, please, let me know. Let me know. If there is anyone, let me know. Let me know. So, there is access to every opportunity, every privilege. 